haul update haul and update sorry I just came back from Walmart I am in the process of getting my room my house looking perfect my mom will be here on Monday and today's my only day off so today's the only day I have to um, do this so I got some household stuff and you know just because I have to hide everything doesn't mean I didn't have the time to go into the baby section and Walmart is putting out some very cute clothes lately and I'm just gonna show you everything I only got sleepers but that's because I didn't really have the time to go through everything and look but these were too cute to pass up so I'm gonna start with Elila's haul then the babies so for Elila's series that I plan to do on YouTube whenever I get her which is her homeschool series sorry I bought her some books to learn uh, to learn <laughs> to use for the that series so it's just the Canadian curriculums um, so that's that um, me being Jamaican we start school way earlier than the Canadians do we start at age two two to two to three years old so um, most of the Alila is portraying a two-year-old and most of these things we'd already be like doing in basic school so you'll see what I mean when I start her series as soon as I am back from Jamaica and paint and I've painted her repainted her you'll all see what I mean so now inside the bag I'm just gonna take these out so I got this Minnie Mouse sleeper for Jamaica because she doesn't really have a lot of Minnie Mouse um, stuff and it's just adorable it's like a nautical theme to Minnie Mouse so and I've been watching this these sets for a while it was on sale for nine dollars it's normal twelve ninety seven and that's size three to six months there are some Dumbo and Thumper stuff out as well that I need to go back for, but I didn't want to pay full price. And also because I need to get one for to send to someone in the community. So I'll go back and get that. I also got sorry, this other sleeper here. And it says Little Dreamer and it has a butterfly. And as you know, Jamaica's middle name is Mariposa which means butterfly in Spanish and so her theme is significantly butterflies like if you've seen all the videos of her in outfits you'd notice that she's she mostly has on butterfly themed outfits so we got that one I love the color and then we got this one it's just the woodland theme and I saw it and I fell in love It's, and I couldn't say no so this is the girl version and while I was walking away because it's this set is um, 3 for 15 or $6 each so I went for the 3 for 15 I saw the boy version and I was just like yes now she and Cyrus can twin it out I'm totally in love with this set guys I could not say no so I got it hers has um, a bunny and I think a little fawn and trees and stuff and for the boys it has trees and a bird and a fox I just I am going to do a twin night with them like wearing the same outfit because they're not twins but that might have to be after I come back from my trip. I will be filming at the airport and stuff. And I'll also be doing a tips uh, video on how to travel with your Reborn. Based on my experience uh, the last time I traveled with a Reborn. So uh, that's coming up. And I'm sorry I haven't been doing videos lately guys. I've just been so excited that my mom's coming and I'm ju I've just been doing uh, those videos just been doing stuff to make sure the house is ready for her to come home 
well, come visit. Oh. So, I, um, that's everything I have for you. Jamaica is on my bed right now, but my room's a mess. So I really don't want to bring you guys in there. I'm literally sitting in the hallway right now filming this video and my room's in here, over there, right there. But it's a mess. So I'll come back on later and film uh, a video. Yes, uh, both my fingers are cut. The bandage is coming off, which is why you see me playing with it. I need to get a new one. Last night at work, I was cleaning the slicer. I work in the deli at work. And I was cleaning the slicer. And you know how they always warn you, be careful about the blades when you're cleaning and everything? Well, they didn't warn me that underneath the slicer, the bottom of the slicer, could cut you as well. So, both my fingers got cut last night when I was cleaning the slicer. But it's all good. I am just trying to get it to heal up because I work again tomorrow and we wash dishes with soap and then we sanitize it. Putting a cut finger in sanitizer is not fun, guys. Trust me. I know. Anyways, I'll see you guys in the next video. Um, I'll probably video at the end of the night when I'm finished cleaning and everything. I'll see you guys soon. Bye!